Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Pastor Bill Shutt to lead us in today's invocation. I'm humbled and honored to be with you here this, this afternoon. I pastored the Bible Baptist Church in York, Pennsylvania. And listen, we need God in our country again. We need President Trump to lead us. We need God to guide us. And we need Almighty to do a miracle as he did back in 2016. Can I tell you, my friend, this is not red versus blue. This is much more than that. It is good versus evil. And we need God to rule and reign. And we need God to anoint this nation like never before. As we did back years ago when we country got back on our knees to pray and sought for God, we saw revival and God doing great things as we saw back in 2016. And by God's grace, we're gonna see it again. Listen, America, Pennsylvania, let's rise up like never before. When the country and nations were in great peril, when they turned to God, they saw God do great miracles today. But I invite you, as we turn to God, let's all of our hearts and minds turn to the Lord Jesus Christ at this time, and let's pray together. Lord Jesus, we're so grateful to live in America. We're grateful for how you have blessed this nation. We're grateful for our liberties. We're grateful for what you have done and what you continue to do. We thank you for the salvation that we have in our Lord Jesus Christ. We thank you for the blood that was shed and the burial and the resurrection that gives us the example of love, sacrifice, duty, and liberty. Louis, today, invite you please to work in our midst here in this arena. Lord, continue to have your hand upon President Trump. Continue to protect him, guide him, give him great wisdom. May we as Pennsylvanians not ride on his coattails, but we, we also get engaged and rise up to this occasion of the need of our great land that we may see the miracle hand of God working upon this nation like never before. God, we need revival. God, we need your hand. God, we need you to do things that seem to be impossible. Lord, the invisible working where it is visible. Lord, please do the great work as you did in the Red Sea. Do the great work that you have done in Israel. Do the great work that we have seen here in America time and time and time again. And God, we need your people, as you said, to humble themselves and seek your face and turn from the wicked ways. Lord, that you may hear our prayer, heal our land, forgive us of our sins, and God, do things that America has never seen before in prosperity, in godliness, in righteousness, and great miracle works. We thank you, Lord, for what we've seen. Lord, we're tired of where we are, and we anticipate your hand to lead us in ways and areas that we've never seen before. God bless America. God bless President Trump. And again, Lord Jesus, we pray for victory. We pray for right. We pray for your name the name above all names in Jesus to be magnified and glorified. It's in your son, Jesus Christ's name we pray. And all of God's people said, amen, amen and amen. Thank you.